comes with great responsibility, so I have to embrace it. I am the same as before. After winning silver, I know that there's a responsibility after winning the medal, but this gold medal is extreme responsibility. But again, it's uh, there's a lot of expectation, but I am blessed to receive all this um, and humbled to receive all these blessings. The gym that I built last 2017 after I won the silver medal sa Olympics in Rio. Um, nandun pa rin, okay pa rin kasi medyo maganda yung pinagawa ko. Then the kids, may naging youth world champion. Alawa silang medalist. Then most of national team ay taga doon sa amin. Mga seven national athletes are from Mampang. At first, it's not a good investment to, to buy lot. Tapos <laughs> bumili ng uh, nagpatayo ng gym para sa kanila. But later on, after five, seven, how many years? After that, I, I saw the result ng pinagawa ko. Nakita ko yung improvement ng mga bata. to get more and more popular but I think that our work is finished yet I think we're just getting started I think there's a lot that needs to go into inspiring the future lifters I think the shift in culture and the ability to teach um, you know really good standards and what it's like to be a champion needs to be instilled within the grassroots um, and it should start from the beginning because it's a it's a lot harder to teach um, older athletes or it's a lot harder to teach athletes who's been learning for quite some time, but we know that our influence can reach with the youth or the grassroots athletes and we can really establish a better mindset and I think that's what we can do, you know, because, you know, changing mindset needs time. It's a lot easier to influence um, the youth by, you know, by using what we've accomplished. So I think that's really what we can do is um, be able to use our influence to change the mindset and to develop really um, strong athletes um, in the future. Napulpil ko yung purpose na binigay sa akin ni God para sa weightlifting. Nagamit ko yung talent na binigay niya sa akin to inspire other people, to give hope. It's not me alone. Mm -hmm. Na nanalo ko na ng gold medals Olympics. It's not me lang. There's Team HD. There's um, government support and private supports. So, dun pa lang sa preparation, lahat tayo nagkaisa na. Para sa akin, I just want to be me mm -hmm. because um, parang nakaka empty naman yung I have to please everyone na ilang Pilipino tayo then ako lang magisa so um, gusto ko lang na ipakita kung ano talaga ako at least as a person. There's a lot of eyes on you now. You have to make sure that you continue to, to be who you are, continue to educate yourself, continue to grow as a coach. Just like athletes, you know, in this era, you know, they that they change, you know. The athletes from 20 years ago are different from the athletes now. Mm -hmm. And it goes with the same coaching methods. Coaching methods from 20 years from now are different than now. And you know, I think you have to continue to adapt. Continuously teaching, continuously learning only makes you better. Pressure and all of that, um, sometimes it's tough, um, but it also 
you know, gives me the motivation to be better. Because I know I still need, there's still a lot I need to learn from a young coach. And of you course, know, it's going to be hard for the athlete to trust the young coach. But um, I know what I need to do to earn the trust in the athlete. So it gives me the motivation because it doesn't stop me from becoming better. Olympic gold is really, yes, the highest point. But I think inspiring more new, younger athletes to eventually become medalists. And then also winning another medal in the Olympics with whatever, whatever color would be, you know, great achievement. Getting more athletes, younger athletes. I always hear youth athletes say, oh, I want to become like you know, I've got the Heidi. I always tell that please try to try not to be like up the Heidi, but be better. Be a better version of you and use up you know up the Heidi as an inspiration. I think that's that's kind of like what 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 drives me and motivates me is we want these youth athletes to to really get the highest standard of coaching. My, my coaching is not only do with weightlifting with it also we, we kind of coach them in life and that's one of the things that we discussed um, we talked about how you know we will take this approach after the going to the no <laughs> no <laughs> it's um for me it's like entering i i diko di lang pa pwedeng sabihin na Hindi, hindi. Kasi nga, you can never tell it. Eh. Mm-hmm. Pero, wala eh. <laughs>